welcome again to uh, Run Supreme. I'm Mark Krejci. And uh, today I thought a good way to kick uh, this stuff off would be to maybe talk about uh, goal setting. Uh, first off, I'm here in Chicago. Um, me and a buddy drove up to see a U2 in concert for the weekend. And so I came out and did a, uh, a run. And I love running in sort of unknown places and just uh, getting out there to explore and discover. I think that's a lot of fun. Uh, I have a good time doing that. Anyway, uh, today I want to talk about goal setting, and I thought it'd be an appropriate way to kick it off. Um, it's uh, you know in human nature to dream big and have lofty goals, and I think that's important for uh, whatever you do in life is to aim you know extremely high, and um, you know, just try to work on doing that. I know for the first race I wanted to run, uh, which was Disney, as I mentioned before. Uh, I had never done a marathon before and I thought, you know, why well, try to incrementally go up, let's just train for that and I'll do the halves and the 10Ks and stuff along the way. Uh, proved to be, other than the shin splints and not being able to run that race, proved to be a pretty good um, way to do things. Um, <clears throat> but honestly, after I ran uh, uh, my second marathon, I haven't run a race for probably, let's see, it was April 06. So that's two, three and a half years now, I guess. Um, so it's been a long time. And this uh, spring, I decided I'm going to try to run an ultra. I said, you know what, I'm going to aim a little bit bigger, a little bit higher, and, and go for it. So this, uh, this process for me actually started, you know, a half a year back. Um, and part of the reason doing the podcast is it dawned on me, uh, well, a lot of things happened, which I'll talk about as we go. But uh, I got uh, shin splints. Again, uh, was it, yeah, I guess shin splints again. Um, right as I was crossing sort of the 15, 18 mile uh, threshold in my training, and I had to stop altogether. And you know, and I was still uh, a little overweight. I wasn't losing weight. I was running crazy miles and not losing anything, and, and just getting hurt. So um, I had aimed big. Uh, my original goal was to run the. Uh, Nashville Ultra Marathon in October. Um, they've, this is the second one they've ever had this year. Um, I went and volunteered for the first one last year. It was a cool race. I thought, all right, let me train for this. I'll start in spring. There's plenty of time to kind of move up to an ultra. And um, so that's what I was doing. And it just it didn't work out. So I, I'm not going to be able to run that 50-mile uh, uh, race this time. But what it did provide because my goal is to just run an ultra, not a single race, um, I can just push that back. And so um, the reasons for doing this podcast are to tie into that. Is I was doing everything the wrong way before, and uh, the goal is the same. I still want to do an ultra, but I just have to move the horizon. So my new goal is to um, run a 50-mile race before I turn 30, which is uh, in June. So... Um, I've got a, a pretty good horizon to train and do this, uh, but my 50 mile race, I want to be uh, in May or earlier, and I haven't picked a race yet, I'm still race shopping, um, there's a few out there I'm looking at, but I don't quite know which one I'm going to do. Um, but, you know, as, as uh, Stephen Covey says, begin with the end in mind, um, you know, my lifestyle I'm trying to create is a lifestyle of running, so I'm willing to take it slow. I don't hit that goal, that's okay, because uh, eventually, long term, I'd like to do, um, I don't know what they call them exactly, but I guess multi-day uh, events. I think those uh, would be a lot of fun. I've, I've got a long history and background of backpacking and mountaineering, I've done some, some climbing, and the idea of multi-day runs sounds appealing to me. I know it's weird, a little masochistic, but... That sounds fun to me. Anyway, um, that's sort of uh, my take on goal taking and what I'm training for. Run an ultra before I'm 30. Uh, eventually do uh, multi-day races um, across the world. I think that would be a lot of fun. Um, anyway, so that's my goals. Uh, so a question for you guys is what are your goals? How do you set your uh, goal, uh, your priorities, and uh, pick a race even? Um, and what do you use? And what are your goals for uh, this next year? It's end of the year. We don't talk about resolutions now. But anyway, so log on to uh, the site and in the comments down below. Um, let me know what you guys think. And until next time, I'll see you guys out on the roads. Take care.